Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. He can keep going. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. December 11th, a B-Day here at Windsor High School. Hello, I'm Target. And I'm Todd. We do apologize for the confusion that happened last B-Day. We had some technical difficulties, but that's just what happens in TV. Tomorrow, the basketball team will be holding an annual Hoops for Food School showcase from 1.30 p.m. to 8 o'clock p.m. here in the gym. Schools from all over CT, including Wilby, Berlin, Fitch Academy, East Hartford, Cromwell, and others, Cromwell and others will be holding, will play scrimmage games all day. It should be some exciting preseason action. They're asking that attendees bring two non-perishable food items as admission. So come out and help fill the Windsor Food Bank. The next Tardy Challenge will begin on Monday. Remember, points will be awarded to advisory groups for the Warrior Challenge as follows. 65% of students with zero tardies equals 10 points. One additional point for each 5% above that, 80% of students with get, will get 10 points Bonus, students 100% on time for the entire seven days prior to the holiday break will receive a frozen treat on Friday, January 8th during their lunch waves. Good luck. And now, here's our proud principal, Mr. Seals, with this week's principal's message. Good morning, Winter Warriors. We're here to talk to you from the library today to talk about something that's very new and exciting that's coming up for us here at, high, at the high school. And that's the, the SAT for juniors. In the past, we've had the CAP, we've had the SBAC test last year. We didn't really feel like those tests were great measures for us. But this year, the state has decided that our juniors will take the SAT on March the 2nd as our state test. That's great for us. It's also great for you. You get a free SAT they done during the school day. The state's going to pay for it. So it'll give you a great chance to get a jump on your college admissions. And it's also a test that we like because it's a test that we know you'll do your best work on. The test has meaning for you. So we're looking forward to that. You'll be learning more about that from your counselors. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Mr. Sills, Wednesday, December 16th, the class of 2019 is hosting an ugly sweater contest fundraiser for both staff and students. The cost for staff to participate is $2, and the cost for students is $1. The student and staff member with the ugliest sweater will be awarded a mystery prize. Staff, you can sign up the morning of the 16th in the main office, and students can sign up in advisory the day of the contest. Start picking out your ugly sweaters now. If you have any questions, see or ask Caitlin Kajak or Jolie Nelson for anything. Hello, Warriors. Come to the Buffalo Wild Wings on Monday, December 21st, to support mm -hmm. our class of 2016. The event starts at 4 p.m. and ends at 7.30 p.m. After enjoying your meal, remember to leave a flyer with your bill. Flyers are posted throughout the building. Just rip one off of three coupons off. Just rip one of the three coupons off of the flyer. This week we wrap up Computer Science Education Week. Technology is everywhere around us. Here's a video by James Pinkney to show how great coding can be. Check it out. To just keep working on it. If they ever get stumps, uh, you, whether it's uh, some code or you know it's uh, something's not compiling right or something like that, you know it would definitely. You should definitely 
continue working at the problem. It makes me think more about what's go what's really happening inside of a computer. So like if I'm playing a game, I'll think like how do they code this? Like so it just makes me think more. Learning how to make a computer work and learning what computer science I mean what computers do and how they work and how to fix a computer sort of if you can't find what's happening and to understand what the computer's doing. Everything has a computer in it. Your toaster has a computer, your microwave, your phone, uh, your car, everything that you use in your day-to-day -day life has some sort of computer or computer component in it. And so why just sit back and, you know, what not understand about every about these things that we use every day in our lives when we can they're really, in all honesty, not that complicated. Congratulations to the members of the music department and Ms. White and Ms. Mr. Dufek for their amazing performance at the choral concert last night. Look for full coverage of the event on WinTV next week and our YouTube page. But for now, here's a quick look at the Teens of Praise Gospel Choir. Y'all better do it! December 14th, the dry fit shirts cost $20. Order forms can be found in the main office. The Gay Straight Alliance will be having a meeting Monday after school in C-102. Unified Sports Basketball will be holding its first practice on December 14th. If you are interested in playing, you must have all of the athletic permission paperwork and physician's approval submitted before you can play. If, the, if you have any questions, please see Coach Giza. If you haven't heard us say this, which we do every single day, the Windsor Online School Store is now open. They have apparel for all sports and many styles. Just go to the school website and click on the link to get to the store. Attention club presidents, sports captains, and staff. You can email any announcements you guys have to jgooden at winterct.org to get any information you would like to share with us on the show. We also encourage photos and videos from your events, games, and your classroom. Let's share with everyone the exciting and amazing things that happen here at Windsor Hockey. Thanks for checking out our show, and remember, if you don't see the news during Black 2, you can always follow us on Twitter, where we post every episode and much, much more. Well, that's all for today. We are respectful. We are responsible. We are proud. We are warriors. Thanks, and have a great day. And remember to take your hat off.